All right, I know I said that I would share more chat GPT, but more to come. And the reason I'm going back to a video on spatial um, and looking at one of their games is because chat GPT, since the dev conference, which was last Monday, or which was Monday, um, uh, last Monday has been crashing. So since the 6th, it's been really crashing. There's been a big surge of usage. And I was having problems earlier today getting into chat GPT and using chat GPT. So I decided to go back into spatial and take a look at one of the games that are available in spatial and to try this again. So I wanted to look at a spatial game uh, which is a free metaverse game called Mostly On Up, which I have not tried before. So as usual, I like to come in and uh, show games or showcase items that I have not uh, seen or tried before. So in this case, um, <laughs> let's take a look. I do not know how to get it so I can start running. So if you notice, there's a lot of people who are just really, uh, oh, no, I fell. There's a lot of people in here who are really moving and really moving well uh, with the, the game. And okay, there we go. Oops, I'm falling again. So I'm trying to climb to the top. I'm not good at, hold on, let's see here, let's see. There we go. All right, I'm running, I'm making it, I'm learning it. I made it up, uh-oh, to the top. This is kind of spooky. Please don't hurt me. Uh-oh, so now we got to. Now, how did he jump like that? Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, I survived. That's my avatar. So, look a little weird. Uh, so, I survived the jump. So, again, I think these games are pretty... They're pretty neat for something that's free. Um, I've never played the game uh, using a VR headset. So if you notice, um, I've never used the game playing a VR headset. Uh, I've only used the computer uh, keypad which has been helpful. Now, let's see if I can try to angle this and run so I can kind of make it to the top. Okay, so I made it up here. So there's another portion where you gotta kinda, uh, I made the jump. I didn't make that jump. So this is, uh, I don't know. These games are interesting. The games are fun to an extent. Uh, if you look on the side, there are uh, four people in there with me. There's some people who are on the chat. Um, there's other people running around trying to make it. I think with these games, there could be a little more, I guess, on the instruction side, or there could be different levels that make it a little bit easier to kind of maneuver in place. So if you notice, I've got to actually, the goal is to get all the way up there and to kind of jump through all of that. And there's some pretty good, uh, you notice there's some other players, sorry, uh, who are, who made it up here. 
um, we're moving pretty fast. So this gentleman was there when I started. Wow, he jumped on the the ledge. So let's see. So I'm on the ledge too. Don't mean to do that. Okay. So now, I guess the goal now is to make it across. I still didn't make that jump. And I survived. Um, well, the verdict is, I would say, with this, um, the verdict I say with this game, for those of you who are listening, it is a metaverse game on a platform called Spatial. And right now I'm trying to get my mouse control back. Um, there we go. It is a, a metaverse game, online game on a platform called Spatial, which is pretty neat. So you can go in, you can play it. Um, but I think there are some challenges, but I do recommend that everybody get in there. There's actually more people uh, in the game uh, this time than, than as usual. So normally this is about one o'clock uh, in the afternoon there's usually nobody in there. So uh, there were about four people in there. I saw someone in the chat looking to go into voice chat. So I thought that was interesting. So definitely if you get a chance to try it. Love to hear what you think about it um, and how it works.